outputs coming in. Prime Minister Narendra Modi met uh, the Prime Minister of Qatar and also the Foreign Minister, and talks were held over bilateral ties between both nations. Of course, this uh, development also comes, remember, after Qatar released the eight uh, ex Indian Navy personnel. Rishabh is getting us more details. Rishabh, that incident alone uh, talks volumes about the kind of diplomatic relations both countries have, and now, of course. The Prime Minister meeting the Prime Minister of Qatar and the uh, Foreign Minister as well. There are visuals coming in. Well, definitely, the Prime Minister is on a day-long visit to Qatar where he will be meeting uh, the Emir of Qatar as well later in the day. But yesterday, uh, on arrival in Doha, he met the Prime Minister of uh, Qatar who happens to be the Foreign Minister as well. And the way both the countries have handled the issue of naval veterans who were uh, in jail in Qatar uh, has shown that how both the countries would like to go ahead uh, with mutual cooperation on various issues. Remember, Qatar and India have had a, a lot of agreements in place uh, for decades now. Since 1999, we have LNG set up with uh, Qatar and other uh, fuel setups as well. But with the naval personnel returning to India safe and sound, it has added to uh, the, you know, added to the right. deepening of uh, relationship between both the countries. And in Gulf, India would like to have more and more partners. UAE is definitely an all-weather friend. But uh, uh, Qatar happens to be one of the strongest power or the strongest vo voice in Gulf. And hence, India and Qatar both do understand that they are mutually beneficial right. for each other. Right. Rishabh, thank you very much for getting us the details. We're moving on.